Hello friends, welcome back to my channel. Welcome, if you guys are new here, no I am not wearing the same outfit every day. I am filming my intros to these videos that are pre-recorded. So, today's video is going to be a back to school haul. You guys know how I am about budgeting and about trying to save money and you know, things are pricey, especially when I'm having to pay double, even triple on my electric bill. So yes, we have four kids. Um, they didn't need everything for back to school, but they needed some certain staple items or things um, that they were out of or you know had outgrown. So this is just to get us started for the school year. I'm very budget conscious. So I like to share these tips and tricks with you guys and share things that I get when they're on sale. So we have four kids and that is what I'm sharing. Um, I was really proud of some of the stuff that I was able to find. And I let my teenager, you know, decide what he wanted for himself. We also have some more stuff, um, which I should be able to film that if it comes in today. So let's go ahead and get started with this, you guys. Um, I know everybody's budget is different, you can, but you can really scout things out and find them on awesome deals and stack coupons with them. Make sure if you're look, if you're shopping on websites, make sure you always can go and you guys Ebates. I don't know if you know Ebates or actually it's Rakuten. Um, it used to be called Ebates. Uh, Rakuten will give you cash back. Like I ordered the stuff off Nike. I got 12% cash back. It's free, totally free. Um, I will link, I do, I don't get paid by them, but I have like a referral code, you know, like anybody can do that. So I have a referral code and I'll link it down below and I think it gets you guys some money back if you haven't already signed up with them. Um, I've been using them for years because honestly it just gives me money for doing something I'm already doing online. So. You can use that for, you know, you can type in any of those online companies and be able to search and they have coupons on them and everything and it's simple, super simple. You don't have to do anything but click the button. So anyway, I'm going to share um, all four of our kids haul and then show you some clothes that were, were sent to me forever ago that I forgot to share with you guys just because they are super affordable and cheap and just a really good brand I've worked with before and I'm just pretty basic. I mean, I make molded shirts now. So I wanted to share those, but let's go ahead and get started and I'll share the clothing hauls. Okay guys, we're gonna start here. I don't usually buy myself stuff, I'll just be honest. I'm not big on like buying a ton of stuff because I make shirts and do that sort of thing. But I had a gift card that was $50, I thought it was 30. So I was literally walking through JCPenney buying my um, kids stuff and I thought I'm gonna use that gift card my mom gave me for my birthday forever ago. So. I didn't need anything, like I said, a very simple. So I got this cute sweater. Look at this. This is like just a little short sweater. I usually have big cardigans. It was $13 on clearance by that Anna brand. So I scooped it up. These boots, I love leopard. I mean, that's, I like basic t-shirts and black shirts and solid collars. And I like leopard a lot. So these uh, were the Arizona brand. They were originally $60. I paid $8.99 for them. So they had lots of sizes too. So if you're looking for boots, JCPenney, I got those for $8.99 and then I couldn't help myself. I, I have generic Birks. I won't pay $100 for real Birkenstocks because I don't honestly think that they're that comfortable. And I have a pair I got on Amazon last year and I don't wear them because I don't think they're comfy. I can't get them to stay on my feet. I wore these first day. These are super comfy. These are the Arizona brand, which is usually the brand I buy, either Anna or Arizona for JCPenney. I got these, and these are the comfiest sandals because I live in my vans. Uh, so these were $14.99. I thought it might be a little cheaper because they had coupons going on, but they wouldn't stack them with the clearance items. So I got all of these things for like 30 bucks, and I think that's a steal. So moving on, this is what I got the girls. I was getting Gavin's stuff at JCPenney um, because, like I said, Gavin's pretty simple too. And we get good deals there. So I was able to get these boots. Emily's been wanting the Doc Martin looking boots. And these actually were $55. They had them on sale that day, I think, for $34. And I had a 50% off coupon. So it ended up being, I think, around $17 for these, give or take. It was, I think it was like $34 with half off. So I got those for $17. So I got those for Emily. And then for Lainey, same deal going on. Um, Cause Walmart had these, but Walmarts were a heck of a lot more than this. So 
it, it, Walmart is not always the cheapest for things. So I got Laney the pink ones, plus these will wipe off really easily because Laney is rough on shoes. But they have a ton of these at JCPenney if you have one of those near you. So I got those both for I think around $17. So what I end up doing is, honestly you guys, here's a tip. When back to school is actually in session, if you go to your local JCPenney or even some of these other stores, these shoes will be even cheaper like um, because they try to get rid of them okay you guys let's move on to the next pile just because it's in order um gavin wanted to go to american eagle which i kind of cringe when we go in american eagle because <laughs> i loved american eagle growing up and abercrombie and all that but american eagle is so pricey for the little amount of stuff you get he shopped awesome i didn't say one word to him he bought three shirts they were i think 20 percent off he's very basic like i said so he got this white american eagle shirt it's just got like the little bird design on it he got this, which is this is burgundy as their school color, burgundy and white. Mm -hmm. So he got that one, and then he got a black one because like he just likes basic colors. Yeah. And it's got the little bird on it. So all of those, or I think they were each fourteen ninety six for those shirts. So let's move to the next set of clothes for Gavin. This was in J C Penney. I can't remember the total, but he got this shirt. This shirt was on, he cut the tags off. I think this shirt was like, I don't know if this was like $3. He went to the clearance aisle and looked. This was like $3, so he got this by this brand. He just got a black shirt. He got a black Arizona shirt, which these were super cheap, which is basic black again. Then <laughs> basic burgundy. Like I said, Gavin's pretty simple. He got the Arizona, and then he got three pairs of the Arizona jeans. He likes them, he's used to them. Um, he doesn't like all the crazy stuff. So he got those. They had some ugly bleached, um, and no offense if anybody likes that stuff, but it reminded me of the stuff when I was growing up that they had like the uh, acid wash jeans. Jesus. Yes, then he also got these exertion shorts. And then he got a pair of these, which I did notice he was looking for Nike in there. JC Penny stopped carrying Nike at our um, at our local jc penny which i don't know if they did that everywhere but that was one place that had it on sale a lot of times where you could go in there you couldn't stack coupons in jc penny with nike but you could get it on sale they didn't have any more they've changed it out for champion fila yeah. which is crazy fila and um so uh, they have some adidas not much they don't carry vans in there so i'm um, like they've really changed around what they have but here's what I got for Lainey at Children's Place. She needed a backpack. I had an anniversary coupon for 20% off because their backpacks were ridiculously overpriced. This is $40 in store, but with my coupon and their discount they had going on, you know, cause it's, it's usually not the full price. She needed a new backpack and you know, she loves all the sparkle and glitter and all that stuff six year olds like. I got this for $20 because all the other backpacks that they had in TJ Maxx, they were real flimsy, like hers, hers wore out last year. This one's actually really thick, um, so I'm impressed by that. So I picked that up for her at, Jay, or at uh, Children's Place, and Walmarts were like equivalent, if not more. They had bags for $30, which I'm shocked. That used to be my go-to back-to-school backpack place. Um, then Emily, I found hers. I did find this one for Emily, but this isn't blingy enough for Lainey. Emily's into the more simple stuff now. This is actually an Eddie Bauer one, so I know it will hold up. It, hold, it's it a, holds a lot. Of stuff. Her favorite colors are teal and purple. So we got her this one. This was $24.99. That was Emily's. And then got Lainey. Yeah, I think I got Lainey. Yeah, Lainey, these Lainey's. socks for $4.99 at TJ Maxx. Emily got these socks for $3.99. This big pack of socks at TJ Maxx. Gavin will kill me for showing this, but he, I don't know why, but he wanted Tommy Hilfiger underwear. However, I think he got it because it was on clearance for $14. Um, had been $42. Who pays $42 for, for what, three pairs of underwear or something? Mm -hmm. Anyway, he got those. He also got some socks. I think he's already, he, Gavin got some socks yeah. and he got some other underwear. I got Tanner some underwear in there. Um, I usually, that is my place to go. TJ Maxx is my place to go if, um, if I can't find it at Walmart on sale because Walmart does their big sale back to school time and they do it at Christmas time. That is the best time of the year to buy underwear and socks because you can get, usually get the multi-pack. But I um, usually 
we'll look in TJ Maxx because the kids like the sport brand socks so that it shows on their socks. The boys do, the girls don't care. So I will usually check out TJ Maxx because that is the cheapest for us. And I will usually go um, and pick up underwear for in there because it's really cheap for the girls. So, or the boys, because you know, the boys underwear is ridiculous. When you go and buy $20, underwear $26 I think it was for like a little pack of underwear at Walmart I'm like why is underwear so expensive for cotton so anyway I got um I went to Walmart picked up some undies for Laney because they were on sale I think it was like eight something for 10 and then I picked up um which y'all don't need to see my underwear picked up me some undies that were on sale um and then let's see what else did we pick up oh yes we got the shoes from Walmart also. We were actually, this is part of that grocery haul I shared with you guys. Um, I was going in to buy hamster food, but it came out with underwear because it was on sale. And then shoes, these had been $16 and I got them for $9.99 and Emily needed some shoes for back to school that were just plain. Plus these big thick wedgie type shoes are really in style I've noticed. Walmart even carries some really expensive ones like $40 shoes yeah. in there, Al, which is silliness. Um, I don't know. I didn't expect to see those in there, but I guess it's a big brand. They're starting to carry bigger brands in there. So I got these for $9.99 and then I got Laney a pair, even though I don't think they'll fit her. If they don't fit, she'll grow into them. So we got those shoes there for back to school. So the back to school shoes, the girls wanted, I still got to get them a pair of like basic shoes to wear for gym class, but um, they like they, they were top, torn between Vans and Adidas, which is the girls of my heart because those are my favorite brands. Um, so these are Laney's. She got these. I got these on um, sale at DSW. They were running a special that day. Um, I can't remember how much off. They had been, what? They had been like $60. I think I paid like $32 for these shoes. And then Emily got the same pair. So I think it ended up being like 70 some dollars for two pairs of shoes, which is a really good deal for Adidas. Um, also, another tip is if you want to buy Adidas, you can always check at adidas.com because if you sign up, I think they give you a 30% off coupon when you're a new member. And the best time to do that is Christmas time. I'll insert the clip of Tanner's ugly shoes that he got. I got him some champion shoes. They were, um, he wanted them last week. They were, or the other week, they were $60 when he wanted them. And they are ugly, I think. The, my dad said they look like duck feet. They're huge, but that's the style. All these crazy things are in style. You know, I'm the old person who thinks things are gross um but he wanted them and i was like i'm not paying 60 dollars for those because those are hideous but i found them at journeys on sale with free shipping for 19.99 also journeys has um, got a bunch of coupons going on right now a ton of their shoes are on sale for kids tons of vans tons of um back to school shoes um those big brands are on big sales not for adults so much but for the kids so be on the lookout for those if you're looking for those types of brands Okay, so Tanner is a brand snob. <laughs> Gavin likes simple. Tanner is in this age of Under Armour Nike and stuff. He does wear basic stuff. So um, I will not pay full price for anything. That's just me. I didn't grow up paying full price. I won't pay full price. My mom has taught me well. So I'm trying to remember the exact total because I do set a budget for the kids. We spent under our budget. So Tanner wanted this shirt. I got this on a big sale. It was like, what was that? Maybe some of these shirts were only $13 on um, Nike.com. So I got that for Tanner. These are <laughs> what Tanner requested. I got these crazy shorts on sale. These, okay, so his French Terry shorts. Uh, I don't remember what the actual price was before. It was something ridiculous. Um, I had a coupon. 20% off of everything and they were having a sale so these were $16.78 so for his size um, that is cheap TJ Maxx used to be the cheapest place for us to buy Nike when you get those matching sets but now it's more expensive there so I got those Nike shorts for him he got this Nike football shirt I think this was $10.38 for that which is not bad for Nike and then he got this Nike shirt. This is one of those dry 
uh, materials. And yes, he likes black and white colors, if you didn't notice. I got this top for $12.78. Tanner wears like between an extra large and a large. It really just depends. He like never gains any weight. He just stretches out and gets taller. So he also has a hoodie and a um, pair of pants. So I'll pop those on here if they come in today. Then at Under Armour, we got some stuff. So I think the total for Tanner's for this, this, these shorts, a hoodie, and another shirt was like 90 some dollars for Nike. So um, Tanner got this shirt by Under Armour. He's very selective in what he likes. I got these all on a big sale also. I went to underarmor.com. Honestly, guys, sometimes going to the actual website of the retailer, sometimes it's a heck of a lot more expensive. Sometimes it's a lot cheaper. Um, if you can stack coupons, you can sign up for their emails. Like Under Armour, they will give you a 15% off coupon if you sign up for their emails. And I have a million email addresses, so I tend to sign up for them when I do it. Plus free shipping. Um, Tanner got this Under Armour shirt, which is very, like Ella said, all this stuff matches each other. It's yeah. all the same. It's all the um, same. But he likes it, so it's his style. And he got this Under Armour shirt. And I think, yeah, he got all these shirts. So I think that may have only been 60 some dollars for that. Uh, but that is Tanner's very simple wardrobe. And now we will, um, I'm going to show you what I got Emily at Dick's one day when it was on a big clearance. So for Emily, I had to run in Dick's to get Tanner's football cleats, which I did get those on sale. Um, Emily likes champion. Also, they had these on like the outside sale. They were 22. These were marked down to $10. So I got her these little champion pants, which I did notice right now, all of the boys champion stuff. Um, like the shorts and shirts are like mix and match, buy one, get one um, half off, I think, or buy one, get one free, something like that. Yeah, buy one, get one free. And then I got her this championship shirt, which ended up being cheaper even than TJ Maxx has it right now. I got that for $12.97, but I had rewards, so I was able to get Tater's cleats and these two, these two outfits, I think, and something else for like, I don't know, $55, $60, something like that. So really good deal there. Now I will show you what I got Emily. Actually, before I show you that, I'm going to show you um, something. Right. So a while back, I've partnered with Amora 2 before. I will link them below, you guys. They're just incredibly kind. They sent me some clothes a while back. I did, I did receive dresses last year, and I don't wear dresses very often, but I do like wearing theirs because they're simple, and they're comfy, and they're affordable. So I'll show you some stuff that they sent me. I don't want to try them on. But I'll just show you some of these like keyhole um, shirts, which seem to be really popular. The girls like them. Their stuff is very inexpensive and it's very well made. And as if you notice, my kids are pretty simple. So am I. <laughs> so I just wanted very simple things. I like t-shirts, slouchy t-shirts are some of my favorites. The material is super comfy. So I got a gray one. Then they sent me a burgundy color one. I'm matching Gavin, I think. Um, with the sleeves super cute and the material is really good hang on and then here is the pink shirt which I love pink um, and this material is just so like soft and then they sent me this reminds me I will tell you if you saw pretty woman pretty woman was my favorite movie growing up I loved her her dress that she wore in the movie I think hers was like brown but they sent me this dress, which is hard to see on here. This polka dot dress, which Lainey has one that matches it. Maybe even Emily. Then this one, I'm excited. I haven't worn it yet, but I'll wear it with some sandals because I'm very basic. And you can put a belt with it because it's a little bit blousey, but it's got pockets in it. This is like a little like t-shirt type dress they sent me. This is my favorite out of everything they sent me. I had a picture I shared a while back. I wore this for Easter. I love this color. This is one of my favorite colors. But look at the detail on this. They sent me that. It's got the sleeves. I'll be wearing it this fall. This is so cute, you guys. They have tons of colors. Um, and actually, look at this. I'll be wearing it with that. My $8 boots. Then they sent me this one which is a summertime one. They have so many different patterns. 
so many different collars, so many different things that you can wear. This one is navy. I'm very big into liking navy, and this is a modest dress, so it comes, you know, some of them come really short, this one, and I am very short. This one comes <laughs> to my knees, and they have so many collars, so many patterns, like I said. This one's got a belt, and this is more like a t-shirt type material. And then they said this one, and it's got the um, belt on it, the drawstring belt, and the little button detail, and long sleeves. It's so cute. So there is the Amora 2 haul. I'll link Amora 2 down below, you guys, if you want to check out them. They're on Amazon, and their material is awesome. I wear their dresses anytime I have to go to an event, which or church or want to dress up or something and not super duper dress up because I just don't like dressing up anymore. But um, they're comfy. You can like actually, like I will actually go walk around clean and cook in them because they're so comfy. But that is from Amore too. Now I'm going to share the sheen, shine, whatever that you want to pronounce it. I was very um, apprehensive about ordering from them because you never know if you've never ordered from a certain brand, you never know what you're going to get. I had no idea what I was going to be getting from sheen. Um, I heard so many mixed messages. Some, a ton of people said it's awesome. The prices are phenomenal. You know, they had 8 million coupons. Um, they said, you got to watch what you get. Some stuff sheer, some stuff's polyester material, you know, all that stuff. But honestly, for the price that you pay on this stuff, I got all of the girls stuff for $148. And if you sign up with them, they give you a welcome coupon. You can't stack coupons. That's the downside but they always have coupons. My shipping was free and some people said it would take forever to get here. It only took a week. So phenomenal. I will be definitely be ordering from them again because I am very impressed with what they sent. So, um, and no, it's not sponsored. I wish it was. Maybe I could get Sheen to sponsor me, but let me share what I ordered for the girls. So, um, they say to like really read the reviews when you're ordering from Sheen and to really read, um, like look at pictures, read the reviews, that sort of thing, because you that way you get um, the right size or you know whether to buy it or not. They also have women's clothes, they have um, men's clothes, youth clothes, you know, tons of stuff. So I've seen them on YouTube and I thought, why not? Let's just go for it because Emily was talking about it because she saw some YouTuber wear it or something like that. So oh, I said, friends, okay, yeah. let's go ahead and do that. So um, here's one outfit. Like I said, all these outfits, all their sets are between $10, some are $7, some are 11, 12. I mean, nothing is pricey for what you're going to pay for it. So I got this little sweatsuit. Comes with these little jogger bottoms. And like I said, I can't remember exact pricing, but it wouldn't have been over $10 for yeah. the set. None was over $10. Nothing. And then there's this little leopard shirt and it comes with these little leopard pants and they are the jogger type so these are really cute got those on the website for i can't remember if those were that was only like eight dollars i think yeah. got these little pants they have tons of these they are the spandexy material polyester type material but they've got a ton of those those were really inexpensive um she got they have tons of dresses tons of sets tons. this material is really really good because i was worried it was going to be super sheer and thin and i was going to waste my money but this is really cute it had this little dalmatian Here, print skirt this. and it comes with this little shirt that says spiritual beauty they said to be careful about buying shirts because um something about the lettering on it was cheap but that one turned out fine then this reminded me of Vans. Um, this outfit was like, yeah. I don't know, $9 for this, something like that. Maybe it was it's $6. So, so got these little checkered shorts to go with it. They only had the pink color in stock. But she got those. And then this little dress outfit. It's kind of got like the, I don't know if you call that peplum top to the waistband. It's that real soft material. It's got these little pinstripe pants and it comes with yeah, this little shirt and it's super cute on like all these outfits fit perfectly for her then we've got these little peplum shorts these do come with a belt i think these were like five dollars yeah. they've got a lot of colors and they're also comfy and they're really comfy mm -hmm. this was one of her favorite outfits she got ryan doesn't think it matches but that's the way the print is supposed to be i love these this was ten dollars i think for this it has 
these little bell bottoms that flare out. So they're fitted through here and then they flare out. There's the pants. I'm trying to show you guys. Sorry if Here's I'm looking the to the side. And then here is the shirt. And no, it's not too short on her. It's because they're high rise. Like all yeah. the pants these days are high rise. And then it's got the shirt. So so super like, cute. Oh and then she's oh got, let's see, she's going to try something on. Then Lainey got, because Lainey didn't need as much clothes as Emily. Lainey's like she's closet is busting at the seams yeah. because I keep all of the stuff that's Emily's for Lainey. Yeah. So Lainey wanted some dress outfits. So I got Lainey this little skirt and it has a belt and it comes with this adorable little shirt and it's super cute this little outfit and all of her little outfits were not very much either maybe like eight dollars for that then this is my favorite that she got i think i think she's wearing this the first day of school it's got these little shorts it's got the little belt with it and then, and then it's got this cute little like shirt that tucks yeah, into the that. shorts that's super cute um and then another one she got because these are just so cute i'd order more of these if it wasn't going to be winter soon she got red ones they come with a red belt and then look at the detail on this this is another one i love it's got this pretty little lace like sleeves for her outfit and they tuck in yeah it's really cute then the girls also got these were $2.99 the purses or Aunt Lainey's purse was $2.99 no, they're not the most like fanciest material ever in the world, but $2.99. The girls loved it. They're cute. The chain link purse. And then here is Emily's. Hers is more of a leather, like suede, like a, her material is a little bit different. It's more, it's thicker. I think hers was like maybe $3.99. Yeah. And then she's got the chain on hers and she loves it. Then I got a set of headbands. The headbands were $2.99, I think. So it came with like a set of four. I don't know where the other ones went. This one is beige. They have pink, black, and I think a white one. Yeah. They were um, $2.99 for a set of headbands. That's cheaper than the Dollar Tree. And then Emily's going to show you her outfit because she wanted to model it for you. She's got three outfits she's going to show you. She picked out her three favorites. So she's going to show you those three. So there is Emily's. This is like, I'm trying to show you without, don't show your stomach. So Emily has three of her favorite outfits and I'm showing how the fit is in these in case you guys were like on the fence about whether to buy from them. Um, they're like fitted in the waist and they flare out in the bottom and then it's got like this bell bot or this, uh, the sleeves come out on that. I don't know if you can see that in the camera cause she's far away. There, now you can show her the sleeves. Show them the sleeves, see? Look how cute. And that outfit was like, I don't know, $10 for the whole outfit, $9.99, something like that. All the stuff is super discounted and the material is really nice. Here's another one of those little outfits with like the keyhole um, shoulder part and uh, it's a two piece. So it's got a shirt and a skirt. And so it's got that plaid print, which you guys, this reminds me if you're from that age of Clueless, the movie where they wear the houndstooth stuff, the plaid prints. This is super cute. It reminded me of Clueless, but Emily loves this. This is one of her favorite outfits that she got. And it's super cute. So if I can find some more, I'll order those. Cause like it was $10.99, I think for that outfit. Here's another outfit. This one was really inexpensive also, maybe $6.99. First daddy said no, because he thought her stomach was gonna <laughs> show for school. But they're, it's where they're high-waisted pants yeah, now. Those are popular. Up higher. And then the shirts come, the shirts are more cropped, but the pants come up high to like offset that. So that little outfit is one of her favorites. She's already worn it twice and she wanted to show you. They had a ton of these types of outfits, but we were just getting one to start just to see if it would actually fit right. But super cute, you guys. And here is her um, favorite little t-shirt dress. The material is really soft. Um, mm -hmm. in this and it fits so cute on her. She looks like all grown up. She's only eight. <laughs> so this was one of her favorites. I would order more of these if I can find some more of these because they're super cute and comfy. She's very yeah, simple. So comfy. She likes sporty stuff, but still girly. So mm -hmm. she loves this. And I think that was like $5.99 for that t-shirt dress. So those are her favorite things, you guys. So be sure to check out Sheen. Um, and Sheen, if you want to sponsor me, go right ahead. But, um, she loved all of the outfits that she got yeah, and really Lainey comfy. loved all the outfits too. So very impressed with them, you guys. And that will conclude the shopping haul. But like I said, if Tanner's stuff comes in today, I'll include that. 
Uh, we still got to get Gavin some back to school shoes because he wanted some um, shoes he bought with his own money from his job because I will not buy Gavin's solid white shoes because he's terrible with them. So um, he just wanted some cheapo shoes. So I'm going to get him some, um, what is that brand that's so popular everybody loves? Um, his shoes are worn out. He's very simple, like I said. He said he didn't need any shoes. I said, yes, you do. So I'm gonna get him some of those, um, those Hey Dude shoes. So he wanted some black Hey Dudes, so Gavin will get those. Um, I just need to get, um, the girls have, usually I get them a pair of tennis shoes and a pair of like regular shoes because their other stuff a lot of times still fits. Tanner's shoes are, he's outgrowing everything like so quickly. It's insane. So he's at that age, he's 12. But um, I still need to get the girls some athletic shoes if they've outgrown theirs. That way they have them for gym class, things like that. They've got their casual shoes. So like we're pretty simple, pretty basic around here. And honestly, all this stuff came in under the budget that I set out for each of the kids. Yeah. So very pleased with that, you guys. But I just wanted to share that. There's tips and tricks, you know, for how you can budget and save money. Um, I am not an impulse buyer. I don't run out and buy just things, um, which my kids don't always like that. I won't just go and grab things just because they're on the rack and just to have them at that moment. I will budget things out. I will find the best deal. And that way you can maximize what you're getting instead of buying one shirt that might be $40 in store just because it's there right then and there. That's going to limit what we can buy. So I would rather look for it, get the same thing at a fraction of the cost. That way you can buy more stuff. So it's all in how you use your money. So I just want to share that with you guys. So Tanner's weird pants came in. So I said I would show them if they came in. So here they are, which I like the price on them, but they're just odd. But he likes them. So those are his sweatpants to go with his school stuff. And then here was that sweatshirt that he picked out. That we got on sale yeah because the original price was 50 i think i don't know the price was like 20 dollars that we paid for it but there's that okay my friends that's gonna be it for today's video i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope it gave you some ideas for what you can get on sale if you really search for them and i appreciate you guys watching i hope you have an awesome day and i will see you in the next one love you guys bye